Hello, my name is Lars Bullinger. I am currently the head of hematology oncology of the Charité University Medicine at the Charité Wilcho campus. And um, I have been presenting some work on a big data project, uh, which we perform within a large European private public partnership called the Harmony Alliance. And I have been talking about how gathering together data sets on acute myeloid leukemia, how these big data sets can be clinical practice changing. I think you're all aware that over the last years from large trials, we have learned quite a bit about the prognostic impact of molecular markers. And currently there is already six genes, six molecular markers incorporated into the guidelines of the European leukemia net. But now having put together over 5,000 data sets across Europe, we have the power to identify additional gene-gene interactions that can provide additional prognostic information. Um, that means that we can better predict outcome for distinct genotypes. And there we, for example, have identified the gene PTPN11 to play a, a large role. And then these large data sets can also help us to identify new predictive markers. This would be gene mutations that, for example, can um, predict um, for the effect of, for example, consolidation therapy with an allogeneic transplantation. And in that way, um, those big data sets allow us to better capture the molecular heterogeneity of the disease and to ultimately then improve the management of our patients in a in our daily clinical routine.